a popular neighborhood pizza parlor in Greensboro was recently named number three among the top ten farm-to-table restaurants in the United States. Sticks and Stones Clay Oven Pizza proves that using locally sourced sustainable ingredients fits wonderfully into the world of pizza and can even become a strong drawing card. We join Bob Garner now for a closer look in tonight's house special. Show up Saturday morning at the corner of Walker and Elam near UNCG and you'll find a neighborhood farmer's market in the Sticks and Stones parking lot. The farm to table pizza parlor showcases fresh, local and sustainable ingredients. Stone ground organic flour for the dough, grass fed beef and pasture raised pork, hormone and antibiotic free milk, cream and butter, goat cheese, free range eggs and all sorts of fresh produce and herbs. Owner Neil Reitzel grew up and did business in this neighborhood and had a clear vision for the place. Be as sustainable as possible and as local as possible. Um, and things kind of just came to us. They kind of fell into place. Like the farmer's market came to us, which just made it that much more of a, a local, sustainable business. The neighborhood's been a, a huge support. It's, it's a great old neighborhood, so can't go wrong with that. All the pizza is cooked in a wood-fired oven. This particular pizza is called to be the one. And if you're only going to have one, of course you would have a classic margarita, tomato sauce, mozzarella, parmesan, and fresh basil. Now I started with the very simplest type of pizza because there is absolutely no end to the variety and the complexity you can build into a pizza at Sticks and Stones. I often come and get a pizza with potatoes and basil and goat lady cheese, our local uh, from our local place here and um, I love that on the menu you can create your own and that all three of us when we come together can each get our own pizza that has local fresh really good ingredients. I love homemade pizza. It's one that you can tell that they construct it and they use wonderful ingredients so anything with goat cheese and mushrooms and olives and you don't usually find those ingredients on a pizza. Plus I can get gluten free pizza which is something I eat. Well it's locally owned and I'm a big supporter of anything that's locally owned and they use local ingredients and the flavors are so good that you, you know the tomato sauce is homemade and not out of a can. We live in Yakin County so we've driven quite a ways. And I looked on the internet last night and I wrote in there, typed in the best pizza in Greensboro and this name popped up. And I looked at some of the pictures and I said, that's it, we're going there, you know. Now, if you are lucky enough to be able to get your goat cheese from the Goat Lady Dairy in nearby Climax, you have to have a showcase for it. This is a goat cheese dip with roasted tomato and caramelized onion served on baguette slices, oh yeah. Small plates like this are a really big deal here along with the pizza, the sandwiches, and the salad. That is just unbelievably rich, interesting, and definitely worth coming in for if you never have one bite of pizza, wow. Really interesting list of sandwiches here, including this one, the Goodnight Rose. An Ashley Farms fried chicken breast and Chipotle slaw are the anchors for this little number. Oh. Ooh, they aren't kidding about Chipotle slaw. It's really not that hot, it just kind of caught me off guard. Wow. Delicious, healthy food, support for sustainable agriculture, and a great neighborhood vibe. Sticks and Stones seems to be firing on all cylinders. For North Carolina Weekend, I'm Bob Garner. 
Sticks and Stones Clay Oven Pizza is at 2200 Walker Avenue in Greensboro. And they're open every day from 11 a.m. to midnight. And they stay open until 2 a.m. on Friday and Saturday. For more information, give them a call at 336-275-0220 or go online to sticksandstonesclayoven.com.